<laughs> what do you think about the rod, Cal? There's the other. There's the fourth one. Uh oh. Be attack. Be attack. He's gonna get attacked. <laughs> Around his little bee hole or whatever. All right. There, and there, and there. And I see what might be one, two. <laughs> These rings starting. You getting pretty good at reading. How's it look, pretty boy? What you got? Three inches. Welcome to Cal's Chicken Shack. Hey, have you tried this yet? Just, hey. just do something for me. Just kill. Just, just start it, would you? Well, hold on. Oh, come on. Well, I was ready to pull that oh, thing out. We just trimmed the rod. Cal is checking with a compass. Does the compass tell you anything? The compass. What? The compass say anything? It does that when it's running. It doesn't matter, the reaction itself does that when it's running. What'd you do, Kel? You know what I think? They ran out of fuel line, or they ran out of fuel in the gas line there. What's the gas tank say? Well, we haven't, we haven't even used a cup. How long have we been running it? How long did it take the shadows to move 20 feet? It's burning really hot because it's burning really rich because we cannot control the amount of gas going in through the carburetor because the needle valves are not working properly. Okay, so go down to the bottom of the fuel intake. Measure the temperature on that. 87, 
Go ahead and get it running again. No, no, no. Just, just check it. Now okay. that it's hot, there's no reaction happening. Just check the actual heat. Still seems that the center is cooler. Uh, well, it's cooler by default, but it definitely only dropped into the 300 range. So whether it's the full temperature or not, the pyrometer is v affected by the reaction. Yep. Any way you look at it, there's a, a minimum of 200 degrees. These difference. are thicker. They will retain but more energy. Logically, because they're a thicker it solid. It should be hot and get cooler all the way down. It's just but drop, keep yeah, dropping. Yeah. Thermal inertia will tell but you not, that the not a heat. The heat's gonna work different. That if that was just an exhaust pipe. Yeah, it'd be hot here, but as you go down to the bottom and out, the temperature's going to steadily drop and never climb back up. Well, that's why I'm wondering if, if we're retaining more heat in the feed, because I know the heat reaction is different.